Forests must be restructured so that our descendants will have the same forests at their disposal as we have today. The forest doesn't need people. People need the forest. Wald Plus Limited manages 15,000 hectares of forest and prepares the forest for climate change in the process. My name is Stefan Flückiger. I am the managing director of Wald Plus Limited. Most forests today are not ready for climate change. They are too old, are pure stands, or have critical issues and will not survive extreme changes in climate. The effects of climate change include drought in the forests, bark beetles, forest fires, or the vulnerability of forests to storms. A sustainable forest is a mixed forest. It is a younger forest that binds CO2 from the atmosphere with high vitality and vigorous growth. We determine the need for action in forests by using modern methods to determine the condition of the forest and derive specific adaption measures. My name is Marcus Kuchler. I'm a master forester and I've been working at Val Plus Limited for 16 years. And my job is to manage the forestry service. If light conditions are right and there is no pressure from wildlife damaging the young trees, the forest rejuvenates itself. We harness the power of light to support the rejuvenation of nature and illuminate the ground. To control the growth of the individual future trees, we have to take out any trees that are growing too close. In our hybrid fleet, we currently use the chainsaw for felling larger trees. We carry a PS3000 for one worker, which lasts the whole day with six batteries. The advantages of battery-powered appliances for us are less noise, less exhaust fumes, much less maintenance work and less vibration. Although it is an investment at the beginning, for us it amortizes relatively quickly. We had reservations about the charging management at the beginning, as we are used to taking our gasoline to the area at any time. We were able to solve the problem by carrying the PS3000 on our workshop trolley. We have to carry out young stand maintenance so that we can promote undergrowth tree species. The trees are removed with a brush cutter. The advantage of the brush cutter is the ergonomics. We stand upright. We also have to carry out stand space regulation. Trees that have grown up naturally are very close together. We clear young trees so that the remaining ones are at least two meters apart, and we can achieve rapid growth on the individual trees. We use the HTA 150 saw for crop preparation or young stand maintenance. For example, we can use it to fell young trees and regulate the maintained stand in a more targeted and structured way. When planting, we pay attention to climate-suitable tree species and the choice of tree species appropriate to the location. After planting, we secure the crop. When securing the crop, trees are thinned out at certain points. Only heavily overgrown trees are cleared. For all other trees, the accompanying vegetation acts as a protective barrier. We are taking action now so that we can pass something on to future generations. A healthy forest and so that we can bind as much CO2 as possible to better cope with future climate conditions.